2014 Penticton Fondo, middle of July in a bit of a heat wave. Uh, fortunately it's cool in here, we're in the convention center and here's Bonnie with Pam and Randy. She's just getting her swag bag and timing chip and pretty soon she'll be going over here getting a t-shirt. I've already got all my stuff and then we're going to head to the back. Lots of stuff for sale. Lots of goodies to look at. Saturday and we're just going for an early morning rush. It's not that early. We thought we were going to get it going early to beat the heat. The heat's not that bad. It's supposed to be 34, 35 today, but there's a bit of a breeze, so it's okay. We're just cycling down alongside the canal. Those people will definitely know how to relax. I remember doing that a couple of, a couple of decades ago now. And burning myself pretty good because it's it's a pretty slow long trip. I think it's a couple of hours to go the whole length of the canal. So we're gonna go for a bit of a warm-up ride today uh, in preparation for the big event tomorrow. Hi kids! Riding along the waterfront. Awesome beach here. And a perfect day for it. For everything. Cycling and hanging out at the beach. Great for the kids. It's definitely a good holiday destination. Sunday morning, day of the event, leaving our cozy days in to the start line. Bonnie, are you totally ready? I'm as ready as I'm going to be. She's all trained up. She's I feeling don't know. good. I don't know. She's eating right. She slept right. She's wearing fast clothing. That's really all that matters. Bikes set up, fully sponsored by GPT Builders. Her maintenance guy is coming along for the ride. 
just to get her to the end. That's right. So, we're heading to the start line. Coming up to the main street start area. Here we are. All cordoned off just for us for today. And here's the park where we'll be having our burgers and free brewing beer at the end. So we go in and find our slot in the lineup. You just place yourself based on where you think you're going to end, how long it's going to take you. Four to four and a half hours, four and a half to five, five to five and a half, etc. Just place yourself roughly in the right section. Oh, looks like we're getting photo ops at the front. Must be the local team. Ride hard and smile often. Yeah, I think we'll try and do that. Okay, at the start line, there's Sarah Hughes in the middle. I'm sure we'll catch up with her at some point. And we've got some other big names here. Trevor Linden, Barney Bentel, Alison Sider, and several others. Ladies and gentlemen, we ask you now to please welcome Barney Bentel. He's going to sing the national anthem, so we could ask you to climb down to your in for a treat right now. Hello. Oh, Canada, our home and native land. Okay, so we've found our section. We're about a third of the way back from the front. It goes a long way back behind Bonnie. And then, see the start line. It says Bright Hard, Smile Often. That's where the fast guys are. We'll be catching them later, I'm sure. So, we're all set. How are you feeling, Bonnie? <laughs> she's good. That's all the energy she's got. And we See, we've got uh, three Olympic medalists that were right there at the start line in uh, Alison Sidoin, Clara Hughes, and of course in the man himself, Mr. Ashel, and the daughter, Here we are, just leaving Penticton. Just climbed up the hill. First hill for a first little loop, and then we're back through Penticton, and then heading north. All right, so we've got one little loop.
what a day. So far temperature is not too bad, but it is supposed to get up to 36. And with this being a five hour race for us, five to six, we're gonna be in the heat of it by the end. There's an old paddle steamer that used to run on this lake in the teens and the twenties. I think they retired it. 30 or something and it's been a restaurant and a museum ever since. Just a museum now I think. Beautiful day. Alright. Coming around to the canal. Okay, anywhere here. Yeah, there's Randy. <laughs> All right, that was just Pam and Randy. Okay, we are at the King of the Mountain Hill. I just sprinted ahead, so I'm a little out of breath. Uh, we're at about the 30k mark. Just coming out of Summerland. Here's Bonnie. And there's actually a $500 prize for the winner of the hill climb in each age category. But I don't think we're gonna be eligible for that. Lots of supporters on the side of the roads. The cowbells. An awesome day. <laughs> so far, so good. Just a beautiful day for a Sunday ride with 2,600 of our closest friends. 160 kilometers. We're at the uh, third feed station beside the pull into this one. I mean, this is the second. Second, you see everyone rolling in here. Some people just rolling straight on by. There's Bonnie going to get a stinger. And just leaving this. The feed station, nice. Woo! Awesome support. And we're off again. There she is. Hi. Yeah. Oh, I know.
coming up to the uh, lunch break, going through some beautiful vineyard countryside. And it's been hot. 36 degrees is what they said. Could be even hotter than that in places. And uh, amazingly, I'm doing okay with the heat, but uh, Barney is definitely feeling it. Here's our support group. Here they are. And we're happy to be at the at the lunch break. Hello! Yeah! Everyone's taking pictures of everyone else. If you guys stand over this way, we'll take a picture of you guys yep. with the wine. All right. How are you doing? It was worth the wait. Do you want some more spray? I need to Now she's cooling down. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Refreshing. All right, Bonnie and the support crew, they patched her up, cooled her down. She's good for another 80 kilometers. Okay. We hope. Where's your bike? Bike's over here. Yeah. All right. Lacey had the bike in the stable, it was in getting some hay. <laughs> All ready to go. You saddle. Do you guys now have time to stay for a glass of wine before you head off? Yes, yes, oh, we do. Yes. <laughs> definitely some heat exhaustion happening.